All right. Uh, you'll notice that the menu is different from what um, some applications use the menu as. I try to separate it so that you don't have all these different icons uh, to where you have to choose from. So I have some that are attributed to the, uh, the menu button um, where you'll notice and it scrolls over. And then if you press the back button, then you'll notice that it also has what would be correction menu items, which is redo, I mean undo, redo, uh, the eraser, and the knife. And so let me just uh, let me draw some strokes here, so you can kind of get an idea of how the how the undo system works. And the way the undo system works is you can actually undo infinitely um, down the application. You can even undo even to past projects, like I was showing earlier. I was showing the symmetry part, and so it's very convenient, and you can redo as well. And so it has, it's very, uh, it kind of tries to embody the infinite idea in it as well. Um, now the eraser is very interesting because what it does is you can either erase like you'd normally want to do, or you can also define the softness of the eraser by sweeping out of the color wheel. And you'll notice that it starts to define the paths at which are erasable and which ones are not. And so let's say, for example, you're drawing a face. And you only want to race. Uh, you drew this face, and you, you you spent a lot of time on it. And then you drew an eye, and you wanted to erase part of the eye, but you didn't want to destroy the uh, the face underneath. Then that softness feature allows you to do that. It allows you to erase part of the eye without actually destroying the face. So, and then you can redefine the softness feature as well. Um, the knife is uh, very similar as well to the uh, the eraser except that um, it's more conveniently used for when you're actually using a, uh, a paint with a special attached to it. For example, let me go ahead and put embossing on, which is one of the many um, special effect features that we can do in Infinite Design. And so we're gonna put embossing on just to give you an idea of what it does and how it separates itself from the eraser, okay? So let's go to the eraser first. You'll notice that it erases the path like you would think it would. And the embossing though, you'll notice that that the specials actually redefine themselves around the erased edge. So it's convenient for actually, it's, it's done just a little bit differently. So, and that's the difference between the eraser and the knife.